G'day folks, Tazzy here, and welcome back. It was somewhat sad, Tiger Town, as the townsfolk mourn the loss of Gina from last episode. But as I say, life goes on, so let's press on, see what we can get up to today. I guess it's a, it's a day of finally spending some development points, I guess. We might go through the, the grand plan. That we've talked about and um, see how that works out for us so we're talking about um, demolishing the two logging camps I think they've done a good enough job to be honest I'd, I mean you could you could leave it there forever you know and just blanket that completely but I don't think that's a great idea if I'm honest um, just sort of my interpretation of, of what's going on if, if you were to sort of look in there and of course, um, you, I mean, the, the, they're not perfect, but trees are kind of taking up a square, and of course, the plants are kind of taking up a square. So you need a bit of room, you know, if you know what I mean. You, you want a bit of open area for the, for the plants to grow. We don't just want to uh, completely blanket this area. So you possibly even argue we've, uh, we've left it a little late. I'm not sure. No, there's some sort of, you know, perfect ratio that, um, but anyway. I think we've done a good enough effort I don't particularly. I'm not too sure about the apiary. I, I couldn't tell you. It's a bit of a, uh, it's a bit of a different beast. The apiary, um, beehives found near mature trees. Maybe the, uh, maybe the opposite argument applies, and we should blanket it with trees. I don't know, but we'll call a quest there with what we've done. Good and reasonable shake. Let's get these buildings up and running. I think so. We'll, uh, we'll smash them out of the way. We'll put in the, uh, the right buildings. And I guess we can tackle the tree farms. Uh, still not convinced that this is a good way of, or a good spot for it, but um, I don't know. It's the best I've got, so. I think we will do it. So let's jump on to the um, development points. Now, I probably should have done this before I uh, tore down that house. There was no reason not to. But anyway, we got a little bit back, but um, it would appear from now on the raw materials Fully recycled. Let's jump on that. Considering we are about to do some demolishing, we'll um, grab all the goodies back. It's a reasonable, a reasonable chunk, I think. What are they worth? The uh, logging camps, 30, 30, 30 a piece. So then go towards the building of um, the uh, the new buildings that's going to replace them there. So I think we will roll. We're clearly going for the apiary. Medicine. It's going to be a problem. That is the answer. So I think we'll roll through the uh, somewhat useless orchard slash grove and jump onto the nursery. We've got uh, we've got the required material. We can build it. We're going for the gathering station now. So if they're uh, looking for seeds, I guess the herb is certainly one that we would like. I mean, I don't know. Rightly or wrongly. Not desperate for timber I guess we can can continue to scratch around the way we have been but let's give it a go it, um, it goes a long way to uh, keeping us a little bit more sort of self-reliant on you know providing all of these things for ourselves and stone and iron I guess is uh, not quite although we could always swap coal and make iron but Got a reasonable chance of um, being a little bit self-reliant, provided we've got the manpower to do it. All right. Decision made. I'm not sure. I'm not sure why we uh, why we're not snow. I was just looking up here. Halfway through Jan. So um, we've got a little bit of time up our sleeves before farming. Um, it is minus two, and yet it's uh, the snow graphic is. It's not a thing. <laughs> I'm sure that'll change. But we had the harvest sort of back here, or the harvest bonus booster indicator. So I guess we want to work fairly hard on the farms and hope it uh, hope it comes into play around about sort of March. We've got a merchant ship on the way. I guess that's one thing we could have a look at. There's not too many buildings we haven't dabbled with so far. I guess um, the pasture and in turn the hunting cabin is a, a bit of an obvious one that we haven't we're kind of looking at an alternative now for logging but barring that we have tackled well 
coal mining, so no chopping house, I guess. But um, the ferry is one. We could build it, say hello to the merchant ship and sort of trade goods of equal value with whatever he may or may not have. I don't know where they've got that much spare to throw around, really. So I'm in no great rush, although it's uh, certainly something we could look at. We've kind of... We've had to go at everything there, and that's pretty much it. The alternative, of course, would be um, to the ferry would be... I don't know where it is. Trade? Yeah, the grocer. We could kind of sell, um, sell off some goods if we decided we did have something spare and earn some silver coins and um, hook up with the, uh, the merchant ship in that way. We've only got the one development. Um, I do like the idea of uh, putting the grocer in the middle of our little town square. I kind of like that idea. Still not, I don't really like the one-sided cemetery. But uh, anyway, maybe a grocer in there. But yeah. All my thoughts of what's going on, but let's actually do something. And I guess the first thing to do is to uh, say adios to the two logging camps. Which will keep the builders pretty busy. What have we got? Well, we've just freed up four workers. Well, eight workers, haven't we? We might throw a couple of extra builders at it. Get that job done a little bit better, maybe. Injuries. Labourer, water fetcher, Raymond. I like your enthusiasm, but um, you just relax. We'll throw Cheryl in there so we actually do have four builders not counting the injured ray just keeping our head above water with the blackies i think we need to uh, keep rolling with that where do we stand for flax linen etc agave is flying alcohol is flying flax is still plenty to work with same with linen. So we'll keep the uh, the weaver and the tailor doing what they're doing. I don't mind leaving the distillery closed. So tools and clothes seems fine to me. Additional builders, water fetches. What are we doing? Not much. All right. Maybe we can um, a little bit uh, too late, but maybe we can just give the mine a bit of a boost along perhaps brian are you not uh, one of the injured ones brian yeah i guess that's okay i guess that's okay anything else to consider well i think um agave and flax or clothes and alcohol are quite strong so with the uh, harvest in mind i guess we're um making at least a change this season and we'll just opt for lettuce and oats up in here again try our best we are um kind of dragging our heels with food so an additional boost during this uh, year nine seems pretty good to me so what we might do we'll clear um we'll look at clearing the area for the tree farm spot. So maybe if we just confirm that everything there is being picked up and then maybe suggest that everything in there is of top priority. We've got plenty of laborers at the moment. The lowest resource? Well, I guess stone. Stone out there at the end of the road. Yeah. Maybe that's an option. Keep these um, labourers busy. And you uh, have a look at working on that. Clear this area first, and then you can go and grab some stone. Otherwise, we'll just keep kicking on the way we are until um, we can have a bit of a play over there, I guess. Certainly not farming. No workforce shuffle required. Let's jump into it. <laughs> Hello, Snow. <laughs> Fair enough. Very good. Right. Hmm. 
No doubt there's a few cold ones around. Are we um, concerned about our foot fractures? Not really there. Not overly there. It's a bit of a rough close scenario coming up, but um, anyway. All right. Well, I guess um, I guess we kind of do what I looked at perhaps some time ago now, and that is to make that block a bit of a thing. So that would have to be two houses a row in the house, or 12 plus 1 would be 13. They are 8, 13 by 8. I think I want to. I think I want to break them up. Oh, what am I doing? I'm drawing a road. That's a tragedy. Can we uh, remove that piece of road? Can we instead look at the tree farms themselves, which are to be found there? Forest farm. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Ah, oh, damn it. The mouse. The mouse made a move at the worst of times there. Can we get rid of that and try it one more time? Forest farm. 8 by 6 at 48. Correct. Same there. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Four farms of basically 50. We'll see how we get on with that. And throw a road through the middle. And drop a couple of stockpiles at the end. And we'll uh, see exactly how much benefit it kind of gives us. Three by four. It'll look a little bit short, a little bit stubby. Ah... Mousy, behave. Excellent. Ah, oh, sorry if I just shouted into the microphone there. Can we kindly just, please? Thank you. <laughs> Frustrations showing. Raw material timber. That's all we want. Get rid of these two sneakies down the bottom. Excellent. Boof. Do the same there. Just the timber. Now I think the uh, I think these things are a bit of a calendar sort of a, a deal. Or to put it another way, if we were to build those and put workers in them, I don't think they'd do anything until the start of the year. We can perhaps confirm that um, when we get towards December of this year, but i um, pretty sure that's how they'll operate. So, Not quite the same um, slack season, if, uh, if we want to use that term, as the farms. So it's not a March thing. I think it's a, a January thing. And I think they're a year-round. A year-round job there. But um, anyway, let's concentrate on these two buildings, of which we have already lost one. So let's drop him in. While well, we're having a bit of a play. Now, the only thing I'm really concerned with is the uh, pasture. So I'm going to just drop in a bit of a... Bit of a road, it's got to be that road. I should turn my grid on as soon as I can. That'll do. Let's do that and then see where this pasture actually is. Which is there. Maybe just draw a road up the side of it. And um, use that as the guide. That will do. 
let's get that apiary in somewhere where hopefully it's uh, not going too far beyond the uh, intersection there. It's a bigger beast than the, uh, the gathering station, so it won't be exactly the same that we had before, but I'm sure it'll fit somewhere here. Oh, the, uh, the building materials don't stop you dropping the, the building down. It's a bit too far there. It might be okay. I don't mind. I don't mind staying clear. We'll throw him in there. Is it tickling the mountain a bit much? Should be right. Maybe, 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 maybe. It will be fine. I'm not happy. <laughs> We're going to bring him back one. We're going to bring him back to there. There we go. There we go. Let's uh, just maybe throw a touch bit of additional road there. Looks like we got it. I guess we can throw in a uh, stockpile. Seeing as we're playing stockpile games. 5x3 out the front. Yeah. Don't know what this is. Oh, I can't actually... Uh, can't set that up yet until it's cleared. We definitely don't want that. Nor do we want the uh, silly bit of road that I drew out there. All right. Beautiful apiary up and running. Got any stone collecting happening? Looks like we do. It's good. Mm-hmm. Still rocking the same injuries. Yep, good. How are we looking? Middle of Feb. The gathering station is ready to rock. All right. Well, I guess in the same vein, I don't believe, absolutely no chance, it cannot happen. Nothing else is of importance. Might do is just maybe. I don't know. A little tick of where that intersection would be. And then we can drop the gathering station, which really shouldn't change. Yeah, it'll go exactly where the. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, it's worked out pretty good. Is there uh, actually even a bit more of a gap than before? That little plant? No, I don't think they're overlapping at all. So that'll do us. Gathering station can go in there to get rid of that bit of road. I guess we can throw in the uh, warehouse out the front. Beautiful. Gathering station is correct. Apiary is correct. Awesome. All right. Still got a bit of stone gathering happening. Builders can now work on that and not the tree farms. So that's good. It is almost time for the. Uh... All right, just lit up there. It's almost time for the workforce shuffle. Get these farms up and running. We have a stockpile. Okay. I, I don't know. Honey is a food. It's probably not medicine, but I don't know. It's probably not food raw material either, but I don't know. I'm leaving them on. Definitely not. No, 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 no. And no. I don't know. We'll roll with that. It's good enough. We are in the march. All right, I think that will do, just as that popped. Let's have the same game there. Clearly food, herbs, medicine, possibly. What's it classified as? Yeah, well, I'll leave it. I'll leave raw materials. I don't know, I don't know what that is. <laughs> Might be something like, I, I don't know. I'm not even going to try to guess. All right, maybe we can suggest that that's 
kind of good. Now, let's get 21 people to work on these. Let's suggest that that can be um, whatever. Yep, lettuce will do. And you can be oats this time around. Three apiece and fives. We'll close up the mine. I think we can um, put a uh, hold on clothes production at this point in time. We can probably put a halt to clay. The tools. Mm. Well, we'll see how we get on. Water, pretty strong. We'll grab four from you. The repairman is a clear winner. We'll grab that one. Have a look. 22. Interesting. We're three injured. One is classified as a builder. We're almost just one short. And we can leave the blacksmith working. All right, I'm going to steal a fisherman. Let's see how we go here with um, the injured stealing jobs in the farms, which I guess is probably wise to uh, have a quick play with. So they should be fully staffed. Maybe best just to scroll through here. Brian, you're a farmer. Flora is a farmer. Brian, you are not a farmer. You're a labourer. Uh, Isaac, you, my friend, are a farmer. Let's find Flora, perhaps through here. Could you kindly be a labourer? And we should find one extra, which would be Kelsey. Could you kindly also be a farmer, madam? Appreciate it. Looks good. Leaving us with what is probably two injured labourers. And Brian, uh, who is it? Ray. Ray pretending he's a builder, but he kind of isn't. Still got some fishermen happening. Still got some tools coming out. That's about it. Away we go. Oh, what have we got? Oh, yeah, we've got plenty of builders. All right. Well, I guess that's good. Perhaps no rush, but... Um, I'm not sure what the builders will be doing if they're not building our new buildings, so... I don't know. I guess it's fine. Probably not ideal having a lot of people working way out there um, collecting stone. It might have triggered a slightly slow start to um, harvest or at least sowing never mind if we need to uh, throw additional hands in there because harvest is looking under threat definitely want to try to make sure we get a full harvest everywhere we are doing the right things aren't we yeah just the two injuries now The two foot fractures, of course, which means I guess we do have one legitimate labourer, Flora. Interesting. Should we bother? Is it worth it? Perhaps not. We'll jump into maybe the, uh, might throw, maybe the gathering station perhaps. Got a little bit of stone out of it, not too bad. Medicine, medicine, herbs, herbs are not good. Might be under a, a bit of threat there. To throw a lot of people out and about to do some gathering, perhaps. Well, that was uh, nicely timed. Fractured foot person, Brian. 33 degrees is better than trying to do that in minus 33 degrees. 
I freeze up. I am actually going to pause it. Liz. I'm not sure where Liz came from. I, I don't even know where the word, where the name Liz has appeared from. But um, maybe just stick to grabbing stone until the gathering hut is up. Do we get on? Oh, we've. Uh, oh, okay. Good work. Interesting. Timber's hanging in there. Why don't you, uh, why don't you push it to eighty? Be basically two spare per person that way. Well, that's good. Getting on top of the uh, tools. Seems to be something that um, we haven't really been able to achieve overly well. Early June. Progress just shy of 70. Ooh. Well, fast maturing, I guess. I don't know how the... Um... Hmm. We have to throw an extra hand or two at the oat fields, do we? We'll see. Uh, gathering station is up and two are already in amongst it. I don't mind that idea. We did suggest we can have a crack at... Yeah. All right. Well, yep. Work away in there. Oh, hello. Excellent. Wow. Okay. A house or two would be required there. 24 on the food. Hmm. Anyway. Anyway, anyway. Where are we? Just into... Oh, we are harvesting on that. Riping still a way away. You are harvesting up there, but not the main farm. The big, good, fertile field farm is the one dragging its heels. <laughs> of course it is. Of course it is. Uh, temperature still... Nowhere near scary. I guess it's more the temperature than the date. It does seem to vary, you know. Winters and summers, they, uh, they never sort of start and finish the same way, the same temperatures. It's more when this gets to zero, everything freezes, I think, and disappears. But in August... Hmm. Builders are uh, bored. That was a bit stupid of me, wasn't it? Could you uh, kindly come and build those, and please build those before um, we start year 10, or I've uh, absolutely ruined that. Stone has gone, but we literally have no free hands anyway. Okay. Hmm. I'm inclined to just uh, shut down the blackies. They have no timber currently. Twelve degrees, yeah. I'm, uh, I'm a little paranoid about this field. Lettuce are obviously going to kill it. That lettuce field isn't doing overly well. Do people kind of just um, cross the road and work on this big field for us? Cheers, Leopold, bud. Aren't you the, uh, the latest graduate from Tigertown High School? All right. Hmm. No injuries at all. Working five builders. Is that necessary? Maybe not. Let's steal one. 
kind of concerned about the lettuce more than anything. Anybody else we can pinch? Fisherman, if it comes to it. Oop, something binked. Good, good, good. Still in April, so that's good. Not at this point in time, but thank you. I am tempted to um, suggest somebody depart that scene and maybe jump onto that one. Ah, oh, okay, I did not need to do that. We have uh, empty fields with a lot of free and what looks like lazy farmers. How do we get on? 600. Okay. Well, 500 seem to be a fairly constant number. Both at six? Yeah, two different farms. All right, well, good. Good, good, good. It's good to see. Let's, um, let's shut it down. Excellent, excellent. Can we kindly, um, well, let's load these up. I think that's definitely the way to go. All three jobs in the apiary. Let's bust that open. Excellent. Seven degrees. Mm hmm. I don't mind. I don't mind for the briefest moment. Let's just make sure we get everything we can out of this harvest. There you go. Three left. All right. Well, you can have one. You can have one. I hope you mind it actually get there in time still leave one person there you go a slightly a little more run at that one hang in there temperature yes or no i'm aware game all looking very promising hang in there i think we succeeded with the Top oats, in fact, looks like. Barring one lettuce farm there. I only just got it done, you know. One lettuce and it's three degrees C. How did we go here? 900. Awesome. That's great. So we got what? 12, 2100 just in the bottom three farms. I like it. I like it. I like it. Can I just have a, a quick look at what, um, what you people are actually doing here? Final scratch around. Excellent. Successful mission. How'd we go? Uh, the same, and yet it's flax versus... I don't know if they're... Um, I don't know if that's comparable... Between those two, but I don't know. I guess it's fair to say not a failure. Five twelve. Hmm. I don't know. I, I I think I think it's sort of low yield and and not low yield because they're the same size farms, of course. Five twelve versus three eighty four is a reasonable a reasonable difference percentage wise. So. Anyway, good numbers. Good numbers all round. Let's uh, close that down. We've had a rather successful harvest. I think it's fair to say that little that little bonus um, certainly kicked in for us. So it's good. We won't be forest farming just yet. We'll wait uh, more towards December, I believe. Plenty of people looking for things to do. Well, you can organise that stockpile if you <laughs> if you want to do that. Maxed, maxed. Somebody can jump in there. Um, yeah, look, somebody can jump in there. How do we look for material? Plenty of agave, no flax left, a tiny bit of cotton. Cotton? I wish. Linen. 
Well, all right. Yeah, clean up the scraps. Make it until you can make no more. Builders, you're kind of busy. We could look at the nursery. I think with that in mind, all clay has been distributed. Where do we sit now? The clay. I think it was, was it 40? If we were to build two nurseries, we'd be down to 100 clay. So I think we can um, nursery. Yeah. Need 160 timber. But I, I think that means that we can, um, perhaps it's reasonable to uh, get a little bit more clay back into the kitty. Are we down to three? We are. Let's, uh, let's not do that. Let's go to four. Nice. Still got 12. Really. We now have eight. How did we go without... Yeah, well, that, that, uh, that cost us a bit. Try and get our ward levels back up a bit better than they currently are. Repair shop. If there's something to maintain, please do so. The stone has been completely gathered. Iron. Maybe. About to get very cold. I don't mind the thought of that. What if we were to gather? Well, yeah, sure. Just grab the close by stuff there. Do some iron, and then we might. Well. You know what? Maybe not. It's just, a, well, it's probably a, a lost cause, is it? No. <laughs> Definitely not that one. I just want the plants, if that's okay. Well, there's a little bit going on. Just have a bit of a play up there. Then you can uh, jump on the iron, and after that, I guess it's uh, we'll hang around the close to where the warm houses are and perhaps just gather well almost anything any little plants uh, reeds and certainly the uh, the timber because um, once again we are in need of timber right most things are up and running oh 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 I think I nearly forgot the mine last time interesting Continue on as it stands. We might have to look at a bit of extra coal. But uh, it's never been a problem. Really. I think I might have even ran with only, like, two miners last time. Last off-season. Didn't seem to uh, change the number overly dramatically. Maybe we can... They start running out there already cold. That doesn't sound like a good idea, whoever you are. Get your butt back to the boarding house. Well, look reasonable. No indication anybody died. I guess you uh, I guess you lived to tell the tale. Speaking of that, how are we for injuries? No injuries? Awesome. You've maxed out. Good work. I'm uh, more than happy to have 80 for 36. Would you like to uh, cross the road? Well, I need to be careful there. Um, hmm. Changing my mind, I think. Changing my mind. Oh, you're, uh, you're a bit that way too, are you? All right. I'll accept that you're telling me the truth there. Because you're certainly very close to... Damn it. Standing in there doing nothing. Let's not worry about it. I 
just I'd kind of like to get that iron done, considering where it is. But um, well, well. let's uh, let's open up five slots, and whoever feels like it can uh, jump in here. Leave us five running around doing other jobs now. I'm actually going to steal an additional person. And look at the nursery. Alcohol. Look at the medicine. Yeah. We uh, not that we can do anything about it, but um, let's let's just have a look. So there's the clinic. We can house out here. I think I can even house there. So it's sort of here. I think it's a reasonable spot for it. It's kind of a growing thing, isn't it? That's just... Um, what are we playing with? Where are we going? Nursery. Seven by five. Well, they are eight deep. I know that. So those are not going to work. Therefore... That... I guess I guess there not sure why we are projecting the road but let's pretend we did I like how it fits one, one off where were we? Two. Looks like some sort of chance to uh, squeeze in a third if we wish. All right. Well, there's nothing we can do with them, but um, let's keep the builders busy there. We can at least make a start on them and cross fingers. Cross fingers, we can actually use them. We're. Um, I think we're running out of manpower for all of these things that we are putting in. To be perfectly frank. Basically six new buildings that we need to operate. Although we've shut down kind of three. Oh, oh. That's, uh, that's a long way from nowhere, Mr. Fisherman. Tell me that's not a fractured foot. It's a sprained ankle, Kitty. Well, good job. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. Where uh, where are we at on... Oh, yeah, that was death. <laughs> that was uh, the second tombstone for the Tiger Town Cemetery, if that was a fractured foot. Got away with it. Got away with it. All right. Immigrants are on the way. We've got... Hold people way out there in amongst the iron. If you're running straight for this house, whoever you are, where are you going? What is going on here? Where? I guess you've got plenty of life points, but wow. You're, uh, you're not shy. You can't just... Well, you can. Mark? Oh, you're an apiarist. Okay. I guess that makes sense. I thought you were a... Uh, I thought you were gathering them. Iron. I'm still a little bit shocked that you've done all that walk and haven't gone somewhere to get warm. Iron is nearly done. I think we just uh, do a, a, a full-on clean-out in the middle of town. Maybe kind of from, I don't know, there, through to, yeah. That will keep you busy, but um, please don't go swimming across the river over there. Stone at 500. Look at the timber, though. Still, 
we're uh, where are we month 11 nearly month 12 it's minus 21 degrees no um serious tragedy has befallen us august september october no births november it all looks fairly reasonable it's a lot of very cold people rocking around but anyway literally building the nursery that's cool literally building both excellent december has arrived not quite jan oh yeah oh, okay there we go good work 156 we have plenty of spares which is excellent so many things are on pause and yet it kind of seems reasonable that they are which is a little bit weird we have six wouldn't mind two more although one's an injury no the injury is actually technically a fisherman I can find two more people we might uh, pop these open and throw a couple in each I don't know what we're going to do um, come March next harvest <laughs> we need we need the immigrants really we cannot work all of these buildings anyway almost into uh, uh, year 10 at the start of year 10 eh wow december has arrived yes with nearly january it's all good hey hello hello why, why did i click that we've we've had a child hey go tiger town that's the right place that's about the only yeah well i guess there's half a chance there no chance there well okay i don't know but i don't like the odds of having three and having a child but if it's a chance then uh, daphne is 45. time flies daphne time flies kayla welcome welcome kayla great to have you on board awesome awesome okay uh, what was I considering? I want January to uh, turn up and then I want to find two people. I guess a builder is looking um, rather promising. Paul the sand digger. That's really not what I was interested in. Only the one worker in a nursery. Not at this point in time. And yeah, pointless anyway, but still. We are good to go, given the opportunity to do so. How many uh, builders are we rocking with? I would like to, and I think uh, stealing two at this point in time is perfectly fine. We are almost at that point, I believe. So if I do that, do that, suggest you can plant trees. We found a new seed courtesy of the unlocking of the tech <laughs> but that's about it we'll load it up like this i think two workers trees go excellent two workers trees and go and two workers trees and go all right yeah can i uh maybe somewhat boringly remove some of this ridiculous excess going on here just for the future there we go fives and threes I just didn't want to risk running it. I, I think there are reasonable numbers. Depends on when uh, when your workforce actually turns up to start sewing, doesn't it, really? But uh, I stick with the threes and the fives. Yeah, that's fine. 
Yeah. Okay. We're, we're kind of where we need to be, I guess. Not sure we can do too much better than what we've got happening. Won't be too many spare hands at the moment. Well, I guess there will be. I think when this turns to Jan, we might get the slack season and, and then... Yeah. That's pretty... It's, it's kind of a calendar thing. It's not a... Uh, it's not a, you know, summer, spring harvest sort of a thing. So, a little bit different. Not sure what to expect. So we're basically 50. I think maybe double. We might get 100 or the, or the better part of out of each. So maybe 400 timber come a full harvest. I think something like that. Something in that area, but we'll, uh, we'll find out. Just the one? No, two. Oh, two in winter. Not good. What are we talking in the way of injuries? Uh, did I click on an injured? Gideon Lewis. Well, Lewis has health points. He's freezing cold, but... Um, that would be a, uh, a sprained ankle. All things being equal. So, um, no pressure there. Hmm... I don't know what we're going to do for workforce here. Oh, one burst in the last season. Brilliant. How's the timber picked up? Only 78. I thought we would have done a little bit better than that. Maybe there's a, a reasonable amount of timber in backpacks. I don't know. getting close to harvest season again and I'm not sure how we're going to uh, I'm not sure how we're going to work it I really don't Feb has arrived let's throw that one on pause clearly unless there's been a dramatic change nope. anything at all or are we still just rocking the four the four plus trees yeah Well, never mind, never mind. Alcohol's hanging in there. Is the mine operating? It is. Mm. Look at the food. Yes. Brilliant. I don't know. I don't know. I think, uh, I think we're rolling with what we have right here at this point in time. About two builders. Might be a little bit unnecessary. Although I'm not sure exactly. Uh, I don't really know where you would go. Quick recap. Plenty of agave, no flax, no linen. Fair enough. That uh, basically sums up the weaver, the tailor, and the distillery. And looking at our current supply level, they can stay closed. Stone and iron are pretty good. Coal is good. Timber's mm, being timber. Working hard on water. I'm not sure. Um, I'm not sure we want to change too much. The two builders are a little bit of a... I don't know. Look, you know what? You can... Um, you cannot build anything. I don't believe there is. I don't even think we've got any roads to um, muck around with. So you can jump out there and chop down some trees, pick up some plants maybe, maybe find a herb or two. I think we've uh, pretty much... Reached our limit here. Still rocking the two injuries. Both are sprained ankles. It's awesome. We did have a successful harvest. We've dropped in our two new buildings. The uh, apiary and gathering hut. We're about to hit the um, March work, workplace shuffle. I think I'm just going to throw it on pause there. We've got the immigrants coming in. 
one two three four five six seven kind of i don't know nine months time perhaps we'll get a uh, a good boost to the workforce just the one development point okay i, uh, I instantly considered disease <laughs> but we'll see uh uh, it might be a little bit too early for them to rock in carrying diseases, but we can always jump onto it. There's, there's something somewhere. What is it? Uh, is not quality of life. Why did I not see it? Clicking through those. Hmm. There. Cholera. We, we can unlock it right here, right now, if we want. We cannot do um, the measles. We would need a second point, but I don't think that's going to come into play. But yeah, seven or nine months. Um, end of the end of year ten. End of year ten. We might have nearly hit fifty pop. We're almost at mare level. Tree farms. They're all planted up. Nice. Nurseries are built, can't do anything with them, but at least they're built. How are we actually travelling? Well, not bad numbers. Not sure exactly when we fired up as far as, you know, through the year. Um, it wasn't it wasn't the 1st of January, I know that. Reasonable numbers, how'd the uh, April go? Alright, well, bit of honey, bit of beeswax. Excellent. So we've had some, some success there. I don't really know how we're going to um, work the uh, what is about to be the right here, right now farming season for food. Food is strong. I guess we've got an additional source, which is uh, probably ticking along almost, if not just as well as the uh, the fish. They don't, uh, you know, 250. I think we could add probably uh, add those numbers and get at least 250. Plus a bit of honey. So I guess food is going well. But um, not a real lot of spare bodies to um, shuffle for farming this particular harvest. But we'll see what we can do. I guess we can... Um, I was going to say drop the uh, water bearers, but I'm not sure. Anyway, we'll come to those decisions in the next video so thanks very much for taking an interest in this episode folks and we'll see you in the next one bye for now